we have lift off. Uh, whoa. Where is sounds? Yeah, Sorry. that's uh, taken care of. Hi, Elke. Welcome. <laughs> Karin Seiger zegt. Uh, Goedemiddag aan Elke. Hmm. Hallo. Het is gebruikelijk dat je dan ook zegt. Hallo. Nee. Oh, sounds oké. Okay. Sounds oké? Okay? Ah, oké. Okay. On Twitch is no sound. It should be... Um, where is... Where, where do you... Out of order, can you please confirm that you have sound now, please? There is sound. All right. Yes, rainbow with a fine white line. So, so we're, we're going to guide Elke through this live stream and through candy making because officially it's her their first day today. So a lot of new stuff. We gaan niks zijn en kijken hoe lang het duurt. We gaan niks zijn en kijken hoe lang het duurt. Is there sound on your internet? I have a voice. I can hear you. I can hear it. We have um, a sound. Yes. I have sounds. We have sounds too. On YouTube sounds okay. All right. Good news. So Alka, we have the chat over there. We have the live stream on the left laptop. We have so, one camera here, one there, one there, and one there. Okay. <laughs> so um, Alka is new. So if everyone can uh, please join in by saying hi, that would be polite. Give and them a uh, warm if, welcome. If you could uh, tell us where uh, you're from, uh, then Elke has an idea where everybody is uh, from. And there's the outfoer. So, Mag er dus ook Nederlands spreken? Ah, okay. Ja, ja, ja. We zijn niet enkel Engels. We zitten ook niet enkel Engelstalige mensen te spreken. Proberen een beetje te, proberen een beetje te antwoorden. Ja. Buenos dias, saludos desde Uruguay. Mi nieta Nazarena es fan. So Me encanta have... cuando se forman burbujas mandale. Saludos. <laughs> <laughs> from Taiwan, from Brazil, from USA, Russia. Hello from Argentina, Russia with South love. Africa. Bonjour à France. Sunny Tennessee. Well, not this very is sunny here. Rainy uh, the Netherlands, rainy Holland. Is it time for a mint julep yet in Tennessee? Joy Remington. For a what? A mint julep. Mint Hello, julep. watching from Norwich yeah, in the east of England. Oh. Hello from okay. South Africa. Hello, by a donkey. Hello from <laughs> Sao Paulo. By a donkey, strip beard. He's <laughs> bucky. <laughs> yes. From Germany. Okay. Greetings from Indonesia. So add the white yeah. and citric acid. <laughs> Ilse has her head in the candy making. Yeah. Fortunately for us, still he one. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Somebody recently replied, I, I um, secretly think that she's the genius behind all of this. I read that as well. <laughs> <laughs> I read that as well. So if you can, if you uh, acknowledge yourself in that comment, um, please let us know if it was you. She is not 100%, but... So, is it, it, uh, hoi uit Nederland. Hallo, Denise de Haan. Hi from Montreal. Alaikum salam and greetings, everyone. Where is it? Uh, uh... 
Hi mate, what's up? Have a good day. Um, well, thank you. <laughs> you too. Hello from Maine, USA. Oh, I love to go to Maine. They have Maine lobsters in there. It's a, Maine lobsters? Yes, it's, a, it's, like a a sand, it's like a bread roll. That's but with, instead, instead of a, a hot dog, they put a, a lobster tail inside of it. That it's, is so... <laughs> what's the word for decadent? Uh, decadent. Decadent, decadent. <laughs> yes. That's so decadent. So, Rene, lobsters Bedershaw, Bedershaw, please correct me if I'm wrong. Is main known for its main lobster and lobster rolls? Oh yes, with 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 melted with melted butter on top of it. Oh, hello, Uitenhaag. Hello, lobster rolls. Yes, the sunfish met a kreeft test. Zonder van die kreeft. Die sunfish vooral. Hello, vriezen veen. In the end, hello. a lobster is also still a fish. Eh? It's, uh, it's a crawling fish, eh? yes. A crawling yes, yes, fish. Yeah. <laughs> Swimming in the sea. So, if what we... A crustacean. Is a what? A crustacean. A crustacean? Wow. I'm learning. <laughs> it's, it's, oh, yeah. It's all in my A scale, a scale animal. <laughs> it's a weak deer. <laughs> a weak deer. <laughs> they... <laughs> <laughs> Ik geniet altijd van jullie. Dank u wel, Denise. We genieten ook altijd van uh, om te zien van waar jullie allemaal afkomstig zijn. Dus uh, hallo. Um, we, we might have skipped the introduction, but we are actually making candy today. So, today we're making candy for a wedding. So we will write the initials of the two lovebirds inside the candy and that will be c and f if c and f um, joined with a little heart image can we sing any song any song can we sing any song yes i can sing just show you no Lobster candy, not so good. Oh, yeah, I can, I can uh, imagine that. Good night, all. What time is it with, in your place? Love the satisfying scissors mm -hmm. noise. I get the same cutting from the blue. There we go. Yeah, and uh, orange as well. So all this right. is the whole team setup. We can all wave to that camera because we're live on that one. Hi. We do have some people joining us on uh, on the outside, looking to the window. So we have live Chess viewers is asking what flavor will the candy be today? These are uh, berries. Yes, it was ordered by a French couple, and they ordered mûr. Mûr. Bien sûr. As in wall. But yeah. it's, uh, <laughs> it's a language joke. Wow. We received 100 messages. Okay. Yeah, that's well. Um, the motorbike. No, 7 p.m. How many times a day do we make candy like mm. this? Um, all day long? Uh, we're making roughly six, five to six. Five to six batches of candy like this, depending on the size, but this can be two times bigger as well. Uh, hola, hermosa, desde Colombia. Buenas mm, días. ¿Qué tal? Where are you, night? I mean, I'm morning. If you're morning, I mean night because I'm in Indonesia. Yes. Who's morning and who died? Surely you must be kidding. I'm not, and stop calling me Shirley. <laughs> this is going to be so pretty. Congratulations to the lucky couple. Thank you, Belinda Malek. We'll pass it on. Actually, the couple uh, where we are making these candies for, uh, who we are making these candies for, is not aware that we are actually filming this. So uh, it will be a little additional surprise for them.
For those who don't know, a, a mur, a wall, a mur, a raspberry. <laughs> yeah, that's um, very sharp. Claire, ah, can, Claire, can you are you Claire? are you bilingual in French yeah. and English? <laughs> Hello from Azerbaijan. Well, actually, Claire, a mur is not um, specifically a raspberry, but just a. Berry. A blackberry. Yeah, it's uh, creme de mur is yeah. um, a French liqueur made with uh, brambles. Ah, brown basin. Mm. Brown basin. Mm. Brain basses. <laughs> uh, yes, with brain basin. Uh, hi, I'm watching from Thailand. Sawadika. What countries do we ship to? Um, mostly EU countries, uh, all uh, only EU countries, and that's a selection of only seven countries. So the Netherlands, Belgium, France, Germany, Spain, Portugal, and uh, Austria. Where are we from? We're all from the Netherlands and Belgium. Your image candies are so perfect looking. Another machine? are so perfect looking just gonna give you guys some inside views And here is Kim stretching the white on the machine. I'm English and French, and you're right. Mur is blackberry. Oops, raspberry is framboise, but y a pas de souci, Claire. On vous aime quand même. Love your accents, love your videos. I love Korea. Uh, yes, we. Love Korea as well. Yay, my favorite part. So you can see the machine is stretching in millions of air bubbles so it gets white and opaque, and that will be the main inside part of the candy. So we have an oversight. No, no, it's not a. So here you have how the. The bubbly. The white Wait. part. So the white is now all oh, fluffy. I need my uh, sponges. So that's it for the preparations. Now we'll start with the letters. First comes the C, then we do the F. And then we'll make the love heart. Um, Hi, good morning. What are your Alta hours of operation? We have the regular shop hours. Does it cost too much when you order a special design on the candy? Uh, all information on making custom candy is available on our website Europe so it's more for the F What the frick? It's <clears throat> 9.40 a.m. lobster time. Uh -huh. <laughs> yeah, it's uh, rainy. Uh, Eastern Standard U.S. time. Hello from the Philippines. Can you teach me how to cook? That may be the wrong uh, channel. Because I'm really bad at cooking, especially if it's during cooking class. Well, that's a pity. We only know how to cook sugar. And then a more. Hello from C, Vietnam. Coming up. 
God uh, bless you. Prinses heeft enkele weken twee zakjes voor mij gekocht. So now uh, Kim is showing you the C already. Mijn zus heeft enkele weken geleden twee zakjes voor mij gekocht en onze mama heeft ze vorige week meegebracht. Helemaal tot in Northern Ireland. Wow, cool. Now that's a one way of um, getting candy into your country, is just by smuggling. Um, <laughs> ik vind het zo wonderbaarlijk hoe jullie die figuren maken. Dank u wel. What time is in your country? Mine is 8.43 p.m. This is... Um, uh, 5.44 already p.m. Uh, sorry, 3.44 p.m. Sorry about that. Is that table heated? Yes, the black table is heated and it's that, it's that how they are able to shape it for so long. Yes, indeed. Exactly. So the black table that you're looking on right now is heated. That's the one they are making the candies on. The great table where Kim is cooling his uh, pieces of candy on right now is not heated and is actually at room temperature, but that's a solid steel table. But that's, um, that's a very hard, cold surface. And this black table is heated up to, um, I think it's mm -hmm. 100 degrees Fahrenheit. And almost finished with making the F, so I'll show that in a minute. I just woke up and poured my coffee and to my surprise you were live again. Perfect way to start the day. You're welcome. Well, thank you, Linda Miracle Blanton. Looking at this pile of candy makes me so hungry. And unfortunately, my country doesn't sell this candy. Hola, saludos desde Ecuador. Buenas noches, Ecuador. I'm Tate. Oh my God. Yeah. Oh yeah. Okay. Yeah. Arjan de Lange Lotens vraagt of we nooit onze handen branden. Um, wel, dus net, uh, dat heeft elke eigenlijk net mogen voelen, dus jawel. Het is de. We're here. Ja, dit is de F. Nee, kunnen we misschien starten? Nee, uh, om uh, eerlijk te zijn, Arjan, het, het blijft hete suiker waar we mee werken. Dus de kans bestaat altijd dat we onze handen branden. Maar eenmaal ze op de tafel ligt, zijn ze eigenlijk best handelbaar met handschoenen. Uh, en dat proberen we dan inderdaad ook altijd met handschoenen te benaderen. I will catch up later. Got to get the kids from school. A tout à l'heure. A bientôt. Tjus. Hi from Tunisia. Shalom. Shalom alaikum. Meneer. Shalom alaikum. Salam, salam, I like it. I just, um, yeah, uh, offended two two people in one. Shalom, I like him. We want to go to Thailand. Yes. Does anyone want to go to Thailand? Yes. Okay. Well, thanks for the invite, Grace. Um, yeah. Let us know when. Jullie maken altijd leuke dingen. Uh, is altijd een mooie uitdaging, zegt Michael Spijker. Nederlands, dank u wel. Mm, how long does it take to make that box of candy? Well, this uh, will, ha will yield um, hmm, any, uh, six kilogram or about 12, 13 pounds. So that's more than just a box. Uh, and this will take us about a little hour to make. Andrew, okay. Dit mag je in twee, al doen. 
En um, het verschil met het hartje van Danet is dat het nu heel plat moest zijn. Dus doe dat in twee en ga één stuk tonen. En in de meanwhile, dus het is het verschil omdat dit hartje cooling nee, down de piece of candy to make zet, a heart dus shape out of it. Ruimte so she's niet the, heel she's groot the queen man. Anders is er geen hand te veel een scherpere ding. And you can see that she's dus shaping it right now on the cooling table. Dit nodig. And in the meanwhile, Kim and Elke are making pieces to uh, go next to that um, little heart. Ik ga even spieken. Is it a must for every candy? Yeah. To put citric acid in it. So it's. Uh, it is not, not, but citric acid will give you a little bit of tartness and a little bit of uh, balance to counter the sweet flavor of the sugar. But it's not Can necessary. Oh, yeah, no, but do it. And we don't add it into non fruit flavors. So, so uh, you don't need so much of it. In uh, nu, every fruit, fruit flavor over here, we put in uh, just a little bit less in coconut. Uh, or, Where did we guys learn to make the candy? We uh, learn it on the job. And um, that's exactly what uh, Elke is doing right now. We're learning the op de knippies van het vak. And Greetings then, uh, from Mexico. Gaan uitrekken. My greatest admiration is for you, and, and may not you continue to soms reach it to teach us your beautiful gift of and the art. Is. Thank you all, and have an incredible and blessed start of the week. Well, thank you very much, Denise Trigos Glam. Where are we from, Habibi? We are from the Netherlands, and some of us are mostly from Belgium. Etymological. Uh, sorry, we missed that. Hard, autocorrect. So the heart is already shaped, yeah. and uh, yeah. Kim and Elka are providing pieces and to go next the, yeah. and above it. The kindjes of cut. Let's see. Let's see, need the space. Thank you, Shelley Charlton. Sorry to get you rushed into your work again. But this live stream will be um, saved on your uh, YouTube account, so you can always rewatch it later. So on this uh, cooling table, we so already we have, the, have, C, we have the, the, the pieces to go next to the heart. Yeah. Mm -hmm. more realistic yeah you're correct that not only fruit doesn't always have to be just sweet but also some sourness as well this is in Hier hebben we nu eigenlijk zo, allez, in principe eigenlijk gewoon, moet die in de, ja, in de rot. En moet dit stuk zo klein mogelijk zijn. Dus dat is de reden waarom dat we die kleinere stukjes gebruiken. How many variety of flavors do you offer? We have uh, a lot. A lot. And we also count as one too many. Um, so it's uh, more than 30. We have a C, we have an F, we have a love heart in between. And we're gonna make the butt shaped heart, so. Yeah. Yeah. Voilà. Mm -hmm. 
Merci. Merci. Bonne journée. So this particular candy was custom ordered and the customer ordered a rainbow outside. So Ilse is now dividing the three base colors we made on the table to get them in a rainbow shape, uh, a rainbow color, sorry. And we are using six colors for this one. We have a C and we have an F. How do we know how to cut the size and how big it has to be? Um, skill and experience. Yeah. yeah, I think that's that's about it. The easiest way of putting it. It's uh, there's no set um, formula that we can use to um, to cut to size, but it's uh, yeah, just um, sheer. Experience. Yeah. Can we give a shout out? Yes, we can. Do we all get to create your very own designs and flavors? Yes, we design everything in the shop. Uh, we have lots of flavors to choose from, so uh, we can go nuts sometimes. Do you make some of the same flavor styles of candy regularly? Yes, every type of fruit candy we have over here is actually made multiple times a week. I would have Like the sour ones. It is well. sour flavors. And maybe because we are all, always in the um, Do different colors have different flavors? Um, for us, flavor and color are independent, so uh, all flavors can have all colors and yeah. vice versa. Nat D asks, sometimes I see you stabbing the candy with the scissors, on. like making holes. Why do we do this? It's for popping uh, little trapped air bubbles. Um, so, invisible for you guys, we have uh, entrapped air bubbles in the candy roll. Uh, which we can feel, and sometimes we can see, and it's very hard to see, but um, we try to pop them as much as possible to um, make sure we don't have any issues later in the chopping stage. So right here you can see Kim already made five and now six of the colors for the rainbow, so basically all of them for this one. We know there's a seventh one, but it's not possible to make seven colors in one roll. Um, so we have them, uh, we mixed in the colors when we were, uh, when the sugar was still liquid and we mixed in red, blue and yellow. And with those colors, Ilse and Elke made the other uh, colors by blending them together. Hij stoort erg, komt denk ik door onweer. Dat is best mogelijk. Wij hebben hier ondertussen terug mooi weer. Maar um, dat is uh, moeilijk te voorkomen. So we have some...
also streaming to three different channels, channels at, at once. once. So that might also. We're asking a lot from the technology and from the interwebs. All right, that's it for our rainbow outside. Getting ready to pack this one in. Thank you. The uh, fossé. And that's it for our final roll. It won't get any bigger than this. So we're down to stretching now and making smaller. I will so. be stretching out the batch with Alke. So keep in mind, this is her first day. First Give day. Her some cheers or something. Yes. Some positive feedback, some constructive. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> because we have all candy making experts following us on our uh, social media, <laughs> as far as I've learned already. Ordered some candy recently, and man, I'm blown away. Greetings from Germany. Thank you, Selem Terzi. Danke schön. Das ist ganz uh, toll zu hören. The video stopped when you answered my favorite flavor question. Sorry about hey. that. Chas Smeet. Two eyes. Um, just a, a quick recap. Kim's favorite flavor is a cherry or cherry passion fruit. Elke, who is uh, joining now in the stretching, uh, his favorite flavor was, uh, was the passion fruit. And for Ilse and Kim, uh, Ilse and I, sorry, uh, we are both in the violet uh, section of uh, the flavors. Nice. Why are you tapping with scissors? What do, does it do? Well, it... Would like to see you all try mushroom candy. They approaching the final, yes. I'm gonna give, gonna try to give you an insight so on how it looks like glitching again. And it's yeah, it's a very unstable. Um, yep. It is what it is. Connection. Is it precisely what's after the Looking good. Love the color. Good luck, Elke. You're doing so well. Thank you. Thank you, Elwas Fouri. I'm watching from Japan. Okay, arigato. <laughs> the, um, bonsai and, and arigato. Uh, we know the word for uh, Japanese noodles. <laughs> nice, very good. So this is a custom order, so uh, the customer Chose the uh, flavor and the design, and we made them.
we made them to their order. It's a nice view. It's, uh, <laughs> it's just, just by coincidence, it froze on the worst timing ever. But as you can see, we're still stretching the candy. And um, I'm watching from Iran. Uh, what's the white powder that you spring on the hot sugar every time? Uh, well, it depends. We have uh, two white powders that we add to the candy. First one that we usually add is the citric acid, which is a very sour powder to make the candy a little bit tart or sour. And then we add a little bit of white coloring in powder form as well, since liquid white is um, forbidden for use in food in the, U uh, in the EU. All is okay? She's well, eh? Yeah. Are the tables hot or cold from Detroit, Michigan, USA? Yes, the tables are hot and cold. We actually have the table is, where uh, Alka and Kim are uh, stretching uh, right now is uh, a cold one. And the table we are uh, building our uh, candy blocks on is uh, heated. Um, the sour purple candy video is amazing. Yes. Make poop candy. What? Make poop candy. Poop as in, as in coin, cointje, a poop, or as in a turd? Are delivering to Dubai when we have the opportunity to start delivering to Dubai, and I'm afraid that's not nearly uh, in, in the near future. Sorry. Watching from Mars, but that's obviously the reason why we are expanding to keep up with production and be able to ship to more places. What is one piece? It's a ah. Sorry, you guys glitched. Couldn't hear the answer about the elephants and the kangaroos. <coughs> um, <laughs> we haven't answered that one yet. <laughs> so you haven't missed the thing. Uh, no, we did not make any elephant and or kangaroo candy yet. But... Um, Thanks for asking. <laughs> no, 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 make Saturn candy, okay? Uh, is that an a anime as well? Uh, no? Okay. Domo arigato. Klinkt heel goed, ik the Domo Arigato. Watching from Egypt, love your work, great job. Uh, Saturn is a planet of rings. Uh, we were aware of that. For how many years have you been in business? Almost 11. So this shop opened about 11 years ago. But Kim, who is the owner, actually started making candy about 18 years ago. Mm. So he's already at level 18. <laughs> I'm and already at level... Wow, I'm getting old. <laughs> he's uh, already in the advanced player mode. Mm. 
So you can see the table is filling up with um, bars of uh, candy very quick. And in the meanwhile, Ilse is preparing to write on the big lolly. And I am cleaning the tables so we can actually move on quickly. Is it too late for me to learn your craft? I'm almost 40. What do you think, Elke? Is it too late to start learning when you're almost 40? Well, I am 40 and I just started, so, so it's, it's going to be fine. There you have your answer. Elke just joined us officially today and she is reaching the 40 point. What's the hardest design that Kim has made? Because on a volledig een beetje heel mal alleen. En volledig een beetje heel mal alleen. Top, hè? What's the hardest, uh, the hardest, the hardest design, design that you you have made? Um, I think I think my two children were the hardest designs Ooh. I ever made. <laughs> <laughs> well, the e easiest, the easiest ones to make. <laughs> no, it took me a lot of time to make those two little. So in your, in your left corner, right corner, underneath. Uh, uh, Elke Karen Waybright is saying welcome, Elka. Elka. The sound is glitching. Oh, I'm sorry about that. Rubik's blocks. Um, I hope it's fixed now. So Ben Shihade, it's not too late to start learning. Elke just joined us and that worked out as well. Um, have a kid already asked to snoop proberen to make? Has some kid has some kids asked you to make their own candy? Um, that uh, that uh, yeah, I'm not you sure. Want, you want us to answer in Dutch or in in Robert English, Wells? or in Welsh? Sorry. Uh, actually, we had a, a group of kids joining us um, earlier last week, and they uh, participated in a workshop, "Make Your Own Candy," and that worked out great. It was nice to get those kids in the shop. Uh, so in the meanwhile, Kim is finishing up this batch with some lollies and Ilse is writing the big lolly with the initials on there <laughs> and then uh, it's uh, riding multiple horses at the same time. It's never too late to learn something new. I'll be 74. Ah, Dutch. 74. Huh. Uh, Yes, 74. Coming this Friday. 47. 47. 47. Well, it's, but at 74, it's not too late either. <laughs> in Dutch, well, uh, yeah, in the Dutch, the children can here soms ook uh, langs komen, but that gebeurt jammer genoeg niet vaak. We niet standaard aan de workshops. Dat we gewoon ook de tijd en de plaats niet altijd hebben. Ja. Maar dit was nu een specifieke vraag eigenlijk. We um, hebben met veel plezier die groep kinderen ondersteund die het moeilijk hebben, yeah. omdat ze uh, vaak lang in een ziekenhuis liggen. I was hoping to see some lollipops being made as well. Yay, watched from Missouri, USA. Have a blessed day. Well, may your day be equally blessed as ours. Thank you. I've never tried this before. Is it good? Uh, if you have never tried it before, you should. And then you should be able to answer that question yourself. It's the best. Does that, does you, do you taste candy to check it's right? Yes. So since we made uh, candy with two initials and a little heart shape in it, Ilse is making that as well. So you can see she's uh, making the uh, the big lollipop and have the initials written on it. 
Whose wedding is it? It's the wedding of C and F. Non, non-disclosure uh, clause. We'll, uh, we'll show it on this, cam- on this camera. I'll show you the big lollipop. So this is the actual big one. Very hard to show you correctly on the camera because of the shadows. But it's C, heart, F, which are the initials of the couple that ordered the candy. So now it's chopping time. If we are to start learning this craft at home as a hobby initially, what three tools are a must to have and which tools are not necessarily necessary? Um, yes, you need scissors. Um, it's, yeah, those spatulas that we're using, those are actually, they resemble paint spatulas, but uh, are uh, sold in chocolate making hardware stores. So uh, these are never used to chip off any paint, but that's the one that we're using to chop and to handle the candy. Scissors are quite uh, the same as big fabric scissors, but they, uh, they tend to do the job as well. Um, it might, it might come in handy to have a, a heated table, but that's very difficult to have at your place. So a heating lamp would do the trick as well. But a solid cold table is actually very useful. So a marble slab or something that they are making uh, chocolate on is very useful. And uh, as you can see, this is a live shop. So we actually uh, are uh, working on multiple levels at the same time. This is already setting up the next batch of poured lollies, so that will be uh, lollipops with a picture inside. Ah, yeah. <laughs> maar uh, ik ga er twee keer 44 doen. Dus eigenlijk, ja. Uh, yeah. <laughs> ja, ja, ja. Have we tried making everlasting golf stoppers from Willy Wonka? Um, no. Actually, our, our candy doesn't last that long because people are usually eating it very fast. Hello. This candy is absolutely amazing. Best candy I've ever had in my life. Well, thank you very much. Chaz. I just need to drink now. I can have or look alike. No, we we don't make gobstoppers here because they are very hard to uh, to get them in a, that r- really nice round shape that we're uh, that we're having. Love sour candy. Any new sour flavors creation? Uh, our latest sour flavor was uh, mango and passion fruit that we made for our one million uh, subscriber on YouTube. But that actually is already a couple of uh, months ago. So that was our latest addition to the sour uh, universe. So here you have a nice oversight view of chopping the candy. Thank you. 
Also, can you guys introduce yourself so I know your names for my kids? They love your shorts on YouTube. So, we have our... Uh, we can definitely introduce ourselves, but maybe we can take that one and put I'll, it over here. I'll try to so get... we can wave. I'll try to get you guys into... I'll uh, take you through see your coffee cup in other videos. Now I see what it's for. Not cup. Uh, I'm trying to get you guys up and close with a new camera view. But uh, just to introduce yourself, we are uh, Rock Team Rocks and Rolls, and on the far end of your screen is Kim, the owner. He's the one. I'm not able to get you guys nearer with a new... But we have Kim, Ilse and Elke. And my name is Noah. Can you show us their faces? Yeah, it's very hard because our uh, mobile camera is uh, not cooperating. <laughs> no participation, participation of the mobile no. okay. camera. 920. Yes. Not sure why. Oop. Thank you. So. Okay. Cheers. So for those having uh, technical difficulties, um, we are Kim, Ilse, Elke and Noah. Hi, for those wondering what our names were, I'm not able to get them in camera. And you can find all additional information on our website. Deze noot onder andere tegen. En als je hem uitgooit, komt hij er ook niet meer terug bij. Beter als deze vaste stroom heeft. Nee. Ja. Ja. Oh, 
So in the meanwhile, I, I have a, a solution to show you guys the faces that belong to the, the names of our staff members. So on the right side of your screen, we have Kim. Can you wave to the camera behind you? Hello. That's our boss, shop owner and captain in command. And in the middle of your screen about is Ilse. Just raise your hand, Ilse. <laughs> she is uh, the uh, longest staff member, uh, longest running staff member. And then on the left, uh, yes, is Elke. Our newest edition. Newest edition, they just joined today, officially. We had some tryouts before, and uh, I am Noah, the one who's uh, blabbing in your ear. Hello. 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 And uh, just by uh, coincidence, our shop team is not in today. Our uh, two staff, uh, two member staff shop team is on a, a holiday break. So it's all us, just the regular minions working. Our uh, shop managers, the ladies are enjoying some well-deserved sunbathing in Lisbon or some shower drenched rain mm. in uh, Brussels. So, uh, <laughs> pick one. Kim is the man. Get to work, Noah. Ha ha ha. <laughs> yes, thank you. Thank you, Ben. I uh, love you very much. Elsa as in frozen? No, it says Elke. E L K E. Yeah. Or Ilse. Or Ilse as well. Yeah, sorry. It's, yeah, it's, yeah, yeah. Confusion. Confusion. Uh, how was writing? Uh, pretty good. Pretty good. Pretty good. Uh, yeah. oh, we showed you um, the uh, result, but I can uh, show you again. This is what Ilse wrote on the candy. So it's a custom candy for C and F. They are getting married in a couple of weeks, and we made some. Um, custom handout candy for their wedding and uh, a rainbow theme color scheme with cherry flavor and uh, we wrote the initials inside them and I can actually this is a great way of uh, showing you what the end result may look like So this is um, what the end result looks like. Might be in uh, a mirrored image. So this is the final result. It says C heart shaped F, and it's uh, the both of the people uh, getting married. Their initials. And as I said before, it's on, uh, on their custom requests made with uh, cherry flavor. And then it has the rainbow colors. And uh, in the comments, so actually I'm able to show it. On a correct way, this is C hard shape F. I can, uh, you can review this later on, and uh, you were able to see how we made this little candy for them. The candy to be thrown away. Um, no, we don't have any candy to throw away. We try to uh, to use everything that we uh, that we made. 
So um, Ilse and Elke are uh, sifting through the chopped candy so we can uh, make sure that there's no little splinters inside them. And that's the final part of the, the candy making. So um, that will be all for today. I'm uh, gonna say bye to you. We're finishing up packaging this, uh, this candy. And um, saying goodbye to you is the final thing. What? We're uh, shutting down. So have a good day to you all. Thank you very much for joining us. Bye-bye. Bye. Have a great one. Bye. Bye.